go. <laughs> Welcome back to another video. Uh, it is a beautiful day today. We are out in Clapham in London. A lot of people think I'm in the US. I'm in the UK. Uh, can you hear me over this plane? It should be fine. I'm always getting trolled when I film outdoors. Uh, so today we are doing some rugby training, some rugby conditioning training. So I've done the NFL stuff, the NFL training. Um, obviously NFL and rugby is not actually the same, it's slightly different. So uh, this should be fun. Now, I just actually want to say this because I always get this trolling comment. Listen, doing CrossFit workout is not the same as doing a conditioning for a sport. It's completely different, completely different energy system requirement. I can literally crawl from one one section of a of a workout in a wad to the next with like rugby and NHL's uh, NHL NFL stuff. It's uh, more explosive, dynamic, speed, all the things that I don't have. So um, yeah, don't. Uh, well, actually, that's fine if you troll me. Actually, do comment because I need the comments. It helps my video. So do comment even if you're trolling me, and don't forget to leave a thumbs up. That would be awesome. And make sure you subscribe. Now, before I introduce you to the man that's going to take me through the session I might require you to uh, turn the volume down a bit because you will see why he, he's 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 that can you can you already hear that can you hear that that's <laughs> so we've got the main man himself Tom to, to, Tom Lowe <laughs> what's happening name. I'm gonna find some of his videos some of his very serious training videos and, and, and show you guys uh, a lot of this very serious professional stuff that he posts on his page on his Instagram page uh, yeah, Tom, introduce yourself. Introduce yourself to everyone. Hey guys, Tom here. Um, originally from Cardiff, Wales, so if you can't understand me, I don't apologise. Um, we're going to really take him through um, a good, vigorous kind of SNC session. Obviously, because we can't actually have physical contact, um, we'll take out some of those drills. But you'll see the big man blowing today. and um, We can't have physical contact because I charge for that. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you, you also used to be in the military as well. Yes, in the military. yeah, so I uh, served for seven years um, and then I went to California and played a, a year of rugby there in California. He's like, he's such a down to earth. He's always laughing and all this. And then you don't realize that he's actually um, trained to kill me in less than a few <laughs> seconds. It's going to be a full on conditioning. I just thought I'd bring you guys something uh, different to the NFL stuff I've done. So, and obviously as you can see, he's already got the rugby ball and you can see how terrible I am, which is the fun part of this video. So I really hope that you enjoy this one as well. So uh, yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's get going, yeah? All right, awesome. I haven't even taken the pre-workout and I'm already hyped for this session. So I'm taking the VMX Power Shot by PhD, my sponsor. Code OBV25 and you get an awesome discount. I actually have a video of all the supplements I take, so check them out. Um, obviously, yes, I'm sponsored. I do get paid for doing this, but that's how I I can do all this free content. So yeah, check them out, PhD. <laughs> so just carry on as I'm talking, remember, if I say unders, it's that short line, over as you go wide. Okay, unders. That's it, good. Off he goes. Alright, exactly the same drill. Good. Okay, eyes on, overs, overs. Up and out, drift out, hands up. Oh! And that right there is a knock on. <laughs> Okay, start to think about it, we're going to go overs, okay, give me a target to aim for. Alright, off we go. Yep. Yeah. Hands good. up, hands up, hands up. There we go, good. We're going to go overs, overs, yeah, overs, yeah. overs, 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 give me those hands. There we go, yes, off we go, beautiful. Alright. Alright, as you can see there, we just told Obi to try and have his hands up to give me a target to aim for. As soon as he catches that ball, he's trying to fix the defender and then drift on the outside line. He's going to transfer the ball into his left arm just in case he needs to fend. Okay, eyes on, eyes on, eyes on. There you go, an attack. That's it, shift the side. There you go. Yeah, nice. That's try the bear crawls we did this last week. This kind of represents in rugby. You are down and up off the floor a lot. Um, at a ruck position, you're in this fixed position here trying to get the ball 
once you've made a tackle, you need to get back up on your feet really quick. All right, really good leg, uh, leg burner, really good for the core and that shoulder stability. Um, so as we did last week, bear crawl up into the mark, okay? Yeah. And then again, I'm either gonna give you a ball in the air, okay, or ball on the floor. All right, you happy? Yeah. Set! Up. Bum down, bum down, get the bum down, get the bum down. There we go, drive, 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 drive. Looking up, looking up, ball's in the air, ball's in the air. And off we go, nice, good. just going to add a bit of resistance um, never ever are you going to be in rugby not getting some form of resistance from somebody um, yeah. so I'm just going to pull at you from different angles different parts of, of um, the pitch okay and I just need you to stay direct and strong engage that core all right once you again get to the end we're going to stand up and then you're going to drive loads of power loads of speed so same position bare core position first okay set up drive 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 pause 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 Good. Okay then. Yeah. Set up. Drive, 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 drive. Pause. Good. Pause. Okay. And stand. Man. Okay. Ten seconds of power. Okay. Drive. Use that leg. Use this leg. Set up. Go, go, go. Speed, 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 speed. More, 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 more. Go, go, go. Three, two, and one. Drive, 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 drive. Good, 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 good. Pause. Nice. Set up. Let's go. Drive, 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 drive. Pause. Good. Oh, good man. Okay, settle. Woo. Okay, speed, low, power. Set up. Go, drive. Hope we go, 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 go. That's better. Drive, drive, drive. Go, go, go. Three, two, one. I like the slingshot, man. Uh, it's like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh the, the banded stuff hurts. Like I think a lot of people watch that and think it's not a big deal. It, it is horrendous. Like your heart rate just shoots right through the roof. So uh yeah, but it's fun. I enjoy I actually enjoy this. But uh this type of training is fun. It, it always I always wish I did sports growing up because I'm enjoying this. Uh, saying that I know a lot of some of my rugby friends who are injured have all the injuries in the world it's like whenever you meet a rugby player you always say first like what injuries do you have what have you had and uh, yeah that's kind of what puts me off a little about even doing things like friendly games like we're talking about now because I am older and everything hurts already and creaks so I kind of <laughs> uh, and this is my job so I need to be in uh, kind of in tip-top shape but yeah, it's all good, it's all fun. All right, so what we're gonna do, we'll do five passes back and forth to each other. So I'll pass to you, you'll catch it. I'll drop back, then you pass to me, okay? I'll go forward, okay, and repeat that five times. Once yeah. that's done, you're gonna stay here. The two cones there you see are a defender, all right? So um, we practiced the side steps last week, okay? You just make a decision. You're either gonna fix the defender and side step to the right, and off you go, or you're gonna fix the defender and side step to the left. I'll be on the other side of the ball. Once you've done that side step again, I'll feed you a pass. Okay? Make sense? Yep. Nobody would want to tackle that. No chance. Literally, please go past sir and collect 200 pounds as you go. <laughs> So next up, a bit of agility, a bit of speed, and we're gonna practice your sidestep, okay? 
So what I need to see first is your fast arms, fast feet through the uh, ladder, okay? Making sure the feet both go in, okay? Then you're gonna explode and sprint, okay, to the cone. And again, you're down in that power position. Your hair is set and up, and you see the cone over there, okay? It's on an angle. That's your cut line. Where's he gone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so set up, and we're through again. Fix that defender, but then cut through, okay, the two cones. Remember on that side step, you need to send him the wrong way. All right, so show, open up your body. I'm gonna go this way, and then really powerful side step through the gap. Yeah. He might catch you, or he might anticipate that, but you're gonna put him off balance, and that's when you can bring in that big fend. Mm. All right, should we give it a go? Yeah. Set, up. Speed, speed, that's it, go, 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 go. Explode, go, 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 go. Okay, stay down, get ready for the call. Set, up. Okay, fix that defender. Set, up. There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Drive, drive, drive. Okay, speed, go. Let me go. All right, fix, fix, fix. Set, up. Okay, think about it. All right, not bad, not bad. So, go, let's go. That's it. Drive, 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 drive. Speed, 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 speed. Okay. Now, think about it, dude. All right, we're going to step off that left. Set, up. Let's go, let's go, let's go. a bit of a rest but we don't allow that so with rugby nine times out of ten you're going to be on the floor sprinting short sharp bursts but pretty much continuously unless somebody gets injured so we're just keeping him on on these drills now until he calls it <laughs> <laughs> oh. all right so next up we got our laterals again this is kind of really good agility work and to try and practice that side step and the pivot off each leg Okay, once we've done that, I'm gonna to go to the cone. Obi's got the ball there. He's gonna throw the ball up in the air and he's either gonna call time, which means there's nobody near me and I'll catch it, or pressure. That means I need to get up in the air because in rugby, if you're up in the air in the catch, you cannot be touched. Somebody else can jump up in the air with you, but nobody can tackle you. It'd be an immediate penalty. And nine times out of 10 in this climate, it's a red card as well. All right, we'll give it a go. Oh, he's gone! Okay. Right, sir. that sometimes um, and we spoke about that right you want to create that basket so if it does slip through the hands you've got this fail safe here of your forearms and your biceps maybe to be able to catch it because it's a, it's a high level skill some people do catch it like this and it does make it harder for anybody to compete however it's such a high level skill that yeah. Dan Bigger does it well um, there's a high risk for you to drop it and as you see that just went through the yeah. through the claws so you want to create that basket up you get create that basket and then come down okay or if you're not if you've got time, just create that basket and then off we go. Kind of rugby strength condition session without the conditioning side. Um, and this is kind of a go-to drill that any rugby team would do in their kind of um, build up to a season. You can see I've got four cones out. Each time me and Obi get to a cone, we're gonna do a down up or a sprawl just to represent getting to a breakdown, okay? And then we're gonna come back to the line and then go back out again. We're gonna run this drill for four minutes, all right? I'm gonna try and set a fairly tasty pace for him just to give him a bit of a taste of the kind of intensity of a game. Um, and you can see he's gone very quiet.
Let's go, buddy. Good, 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 good. We've got some pace now. Once we get to that last goal, we turn. We forward. Face them. Let's go. Okay, drive, 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 drive. Go, speed, 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 speed. Okay. I feel like now it's fair. <laughs> So it's um, a very kind of generic conditioning drill that we would do. And you can add in different factors. You can have tackle pads in the drill as well. Um, but teams would run that for two, three and four minutes. They'd have a break and then they'll go again. How are we doing? Oh, awful. <laughs> Anything we're going down to the floor and getting back up, this gets my heart rate going. It's funny as well, right? Because you're so tired, you such a simple drill. Even I, at some points, forgot what cone we were at. Oh, oh I gotta go down. The brain just is not happy. It's mad though, because something so simple, but well, that's why I say all the time on my videos, the simplest things are the worst. <laughs> like I'd rather do a chip or wad than do that. Yeah. yeah. I'd rather have an hour of loads of different type of stuff going on than do that again. That's how much I hate. <laughs> Next week, eight minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the thing though. That's the goal is I happy, happily admit that it's not a good thing that I can't do some of the basic stuff that bigger guys can do. So. It's just time. You just gotta keep at it. It's just practicing time. it. Yeah, real way. Like there's two ways. There's a couple, there's many ways you can kick up a team. Hit someone up. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll go quite far back. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's many ways you can kick off a team. I'm gonna try and teach you the way um, obviously that I was taught, but it's kind of a fail-safe way to try and get the ball to go in a straight direction. There's so many different techniques and none of them are wrong. They, it's all each to your own. You see Johnny Wilkinson kick in a weird way, Quay Cooper, they kick in very odd ways, but they all work. Um, I'm just going to try and teach you a way um, from a beginner's level um, yeah. and we'll see how we get on. All right, yeah, but first, yeah. you are right-footed, so just really wake up that hamstring. Let's do some high kicks. Yeah, just fire it up. <laughs> <laughs> now, cut some nice music. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm going to try and teach Obi the end on end technique on a, um, a telescopic cone, as they would say. Um, so, first up, you need to line the ball up to the posts. Um, and usually with right footed players, there seems to be a bit of a hook on the kick. So, the kind of advice is just to slightly aim it off to the right, especially on a straight kick like this. So if you do hook it, it'll still come onto, onto target. Okay, so I've lined the ball up, okay? I'm gonna take a couple steps back and I'm just gonna make sure I'm happy with where the ball is going. Yeah. Next important thing then, pick a bit of, bit of grass. It's a windy day and you wanna see where the wind is going. So we've got a nice strong direct wind, okay? Then I'm go, gonna go forward to the ball. There's many, many different techniques here. Okay, but I use the one where you go three steps back yeah. and two to the side, all right? So I'll go one, two, three, again, I'll check that I'm happy with the ball. I'll turn one and two. It's just to give you a nice angle onto the ball, okay? Um, before I go and kick this now, when I go and kick this ball, I'm gonna try and keep my head down. I'm not gonna worry about where the ball's going. If I keep my head down and I drive through and my hips follow where I'm going, same as the passing, nine times out of 10, the ball's gonna go that way. A lot of people rush and they wanna see where the kick's gone and they arch up and off the ball goes or off the ball goes, okay? So I'll just go for the routine and let's just see how it looks. going to be hilarious because that's not going to happen no way there we go that's it so now you're from there three steps back okay then slightly angle off and take two steps yeah one two okay now take your time i'll just go down now before you start over as well you don't want to start from standing a lot of people will just go forward there so you can actually just walk back and then you start on a rolling start make sense all right, I'm gonna leave you to it now. Remember, head down, drive through, and we'll try again.
It went straight. <laughs> it went straight. <laughs> But remember, I need you coming on at an angle here. Okay? Oh, right. So you can strike it with the laces. This part of the foot here, yeah. you can't be kicking it there. Okay. Yeah. So you open up your hips and you come through and it's there. Okay. okay. You step to the it. left and then you just took away that angle and then yeah, you just yeah, came yeah, directly yeah. on. Yeah. So think, you're going to come through there. That, an angle. You kind of open up your hips, okay? And then come through. I'm just going to show you how to kick out of hand first, end on end, don't worry about catching it, I'm just going to send it that way. So same kind of drill, you want to kind of drop the ball onto the foot here, okay, end on end, it's the kind of most accurate way to kick. There is a spiral version, but again, very high skill, and there's so many elements for it to go wrong, okay. Again, keep your head down, don't worry about where the ball's going, if your head's down and you strike through, nine times out of ten, it's going to go that way. And again, you do want to open up your hips a little bit to try and stop that hook motion. Okay, so I'll give you a, I'll give you a demo, um, and we'll see how you think. If you're going to kick off your right foot again, holding that ball with the right hand near the bottom and holding the top there. Okay, so this is I'll aim I'll aim this way and so we'll see how we get on. I just want to explain to, to you guys as well these kind of skills and drills that I'm teaching them in three or four minutes are drills that it takes people months and months and months of going over the park hours a day doing just to get average at it. So there's no you see I'll be trying this today for the first time. There is nothing wrong with it going wrong like this because yeah. this, these are high level skills, kicking out of hand, kicking off the floor and not many people can do them at the high level, right? So you just gotta keep plugging away, keep practicing the drills. And again, it's a marathon, not a sprint, just as you said down there. Yeah, um, yeah it's all about learning. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> How do you find that? That was good. It is um the conditioning sucked. <laughs> Ugh. Um, but it's nice to like it's weird a lot of this even though I've done the NFL stuff this one is slightly different. I have never done ladder before, yeah. never done the ladder stuff. Uh, obviously catching the rugby ball. Even when I did NFL, I didn't do catch, I didn't do throwing. So it's learning that skill and like even the kicking, it looks pretty straightforward, but it's not. Yeah, yeah. Like I really enjoyed it. Like I like this type of training. It's just, uh, it's hard when you're learning something new. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, Especially with the pressure being put on you as well. I'm just trying to give you game-like scenarios and stuff, but um, more will be nice as well once we're allowed. Um, we didn't really get to touch on too much of the strength side. Um, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, no, it was awesome. Thank you so much. Yeah, good man. And I'll give you the ball to take home. Yeah. Um, practice, practice, practice. And then next week. Uh... <laughs> Hopefully you don't practice and then we'll come back next week. It'll be just as bad. <laughs> you watch, this is the start of getting your professional rugby contract. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, I will. I'll practice and then we'll do more videos, of course. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, buddy. Uh, I'll put Tom's uh, Instagram and stuff. He's a PT as well. He needs some personal training. He's not as nice when he personal trains though, so just don't expect, just because he's a nice person now, he's horrendous when he personal trains. <laughs> so don't expect him to be nice to you. Or just follow his page, he's hilarious. <laughs> and yeah, thank you so much. Cheers, man. I'm waffling on now because I'm hungry and I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go and get some food. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And you can absolutely laugh at me, but make sure you comment it as well, because it helps my video. <laughs> Peace out. <laughs>